Metaperson avatars are unquestionably the superior selection for augmenting your mobile 3D applications, thanks to their advanced features that offer a wide range of functionality and their adaptability to various user needs and scenarios. In one of the previous videos, we demonstrated how to integrate the Metaperson creator into a native Android application. Now, let's explore how to use Metaperson avatars in Unity-based Android apps. It's important to understand that there are two mobile samples. The first one features a web view component that displays the Metaperson creator page and is ready to use immediately. The second sample depends on the Vuplex web view component and requires this package to be imported into the project. We will proceed with the first one. To follow this tutorial, you will need version 2021-319 of Unity, or more recent. Create a new project and choose the built-in rendering pipeline. Open Package Manager. Click on the plus icon in the top left corner and select Add Package from Git URL. Provide the Git URL of the project. Import the Metaperson Creator mobile integration sample. Now open the Metaperson Creator mobile integration sample scene. Find Scene Handler object and provide your account credentials, which you can get from the Avatar SDK developer page. Don't forget to switch your target platform to Android and connect the target device. Then build and run the application. In the opened application on your Android device, press the Get Avatar button. Metaperson Creator page will be shown. Create your own avatar, customize it, or select any of the sample avatars and click the Export button, then select GLB. The avatar will be exported and added to the scene. Feel free to use this example as a starting point to integrate Metaperson avatars into your Android application. Thank you for your attention. For more details, explore the documentation for the Metaperson Creator Mobile Integration Sample on our official GitHub, and watch the Metaperson Creator Mobile video tutorial on our YouTube channel. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to receive notifications about the new tutorials.